When our next guest found out his best friend didn't have a date for prom, he decided to do something about it. And I couldn't love this story more from Las Vegas, Nevada. Please welcome Anthony and Jacob. These uh, schoolmates of yours got a bus and uh, drove in from Las Vegas just to support the story. So they're amazing. So thank you all for uh, amazing to do it. Okay, so <laughs> Anthony and Jacob. So, and you have been friends, uh, you're in se you're, you're senior, the, or are you going into your senior We're year? We're going into our senior year. Okay, so you've been friends since when? Uh, we became friends our sophomore year of high school. Uh -huh. uh, I was in student council my freshman year, and mm -hmm. then he joined his sophomore year, and we kind of basically became friends then. That's how you met? Yes. Okay, and you were straight, and you were gay. Yes. And you knew he was gay when you met him. Yes. And you didn't have a problem with that, you just became friends? No, we, um, I was actually told that he had a crush on me. <laughs> And at first I, I mean, was like, Ooh, maybe I yeah. shouldn't have done it. I have a crush on you and I'm gay too. So I, <laughs> you're adorable. Oh, thank you, I mean, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so you heard he had a crush on you and? And so um, at first I was kind of scared. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, maybe I should be friends with him. That's kind of, because I, um, I didn't support gay rights then, but I also was not against them. Uh -huh. But it was still just kind of weird for me because being a high school student, that is kind of weird to think about. And um, being a straight high school student, that's weird right. to think about. Right. And um, Anthony actually was the reason I began to support gay rights because he's such a convincing person. He can convince anyone of anything. He's such a great speaker. And he convinced me that I should support this and it's a great cause. So now I just start defending it more and more and now look where we are. Well, yeah. good for you. It's, it's amazing when you know somebody, it helps change your mind. Because yes. like you said, you were scared because he had a crush on you, like there was going to be some kind of attack on you. And he, <laughs> he, just, he just had a crush on you, which people have crushes on people all the yeah. time. And it doesn't, you know, ever go anywhere, um, unfortunately for some people. Um, <laughs> so OK, so you tweeted out that you didn't have a date for prom. And, uh, and so you saw that he didn't have a date. And did you have a date for prom? Originally, I did. I kind of did, not really. But then uh, I decided against it, and we decided that to go separate. Mm -hmm. And um, so she knows who she is. Oh yeah, she okay. knows who she is. <laughs> All right. And um, so I told her to go with her friends, and I'd go with my friends, and I'd go single, which I was totally okay with that uh -huh. because I'd love to hang out with my friends on prom night. Like, how could right. you have a better night than that? And then, so I was single. Yeah. So, so you knew, knew he needed a date, and you surprised him. And this is how you found out. You walk out of class. And you see a sign yeah. <laughs> in in the hallway, and you find out that Jacob wants to go to prom with you. I couldn't believe it. I mean, at first I was like, "Wait, why is there a sign? Why is everyone crowded over there?" I'm like, "I want to go over there and see who's getting ass. Like, <laughs> I want to be a part of that." And then they open up the sign, and then I see it, and then all I see is Jacob with his arms wide open. I was like, "That's for me." <laughs> that, that is amazing. That is so adorable. That. You know what? That if that can't be an example for for people in the world to uh, to know that we just you know uh, that you have a, a date with your friend who you had a crush on and he's open minded enough to actually do this. You, we have teachers that that drove in from Las Vegas. Your parents are in the audience. Um, good for you. First of all. Um, I just want to say I know that there are some schools out there that don't support this and wouldn't allow this to happen, and it's really a shame because prom is very important to a lot of people. And uh, what's the name of your school? Desert Oasis High School. Well, good for for you for actually. Go <laughs> uh, that's uh, that's wonderful that uh, the teachers and the school supports that. And uh, so you're going into your senior year, and uh, we want to help you out uh, because our partners at Shutterfly uh, support your future education, and each of you are getting a check for $10,000. <laughs> Thank you.